you reckon? I don't know. Time for a bit. We're gonna have a little tilt, guys. A little tilt. That's a big tilt. It's alright. Look, yeah, not bad. How are we? Can you hear us okay? I'm sure you can, otherwise you have said, right? Um, Welcome. Yeah. It is ham and eggs. It is leg day, right? Biscuit mix. I feel like you're going to tilt with us down, right? You can still see it though, on because uh, it expands. Yeah, I know. I just feel a bit like. <laughs> <laughs> um, welcome to day four. I had to remind myself what day it was then of your February challenge. It is leg day boot camp today, okay? So you do need some kind of resistance, whether that be dumbbells, kettlebells, plates, or household items. You made it, Kevin. Wow, for legs as well. Um, we're going to be using two dumbbells. If you've only got one, have no fear. Ray and Jordan are here. He'll be fine. So, please like the video, little thumbs up. Yes, do that now, guys. Give it a little uh, thumb up. Give please. it a little thumb more. Good morning, good morning. Ah, oh, hopefully you're up all happy and ready to... I can't believe it's Thursday already. I know, we've nearly got our Friday night. It's Friday night. It's Friday night. <laughs> Not yet, it's Thursday. It's Thursday. Don't get too excited. Okay, we are here to train, yeah. so we're going to get uh, warm up first. So don't skip this part if you are watching it on catch up. And if you are watching it on catch up and it's not Thursday the 4th of February, enjoy your workout. Whatever oh, day you're doing. How good is that? It's Thursday the 4th and it's day 4. Wow. That's impressive, then. I suppose, though, we did start on Thursday. Well, we're going to do on day 6 because it's going to be like the 8th. Yeah, it's alright. Don't worry. Right. Let's Again. go. <laughs> Jogging on the spot then. Let's get these legs nice and warm. Let's go. All legs today. Are you ready for it? Of course. Twisting through the back and hips. Click as you kick. Do you know what? I've just said that, but of course, every day this week's been the day and the day, isn't it? We start on the first. Yes. Aspen walkouts. Let's go. Down we go. Oh. Make sure we're really stretching the legs out because we're going to be using them just like every day. <laughs> every day, <the> legs <laughs> good. One more time. I feel like on a Monday, my hands can walk out is really good, and then by first, I'm like, Ugh. <laughs> staying down, right arm, right leg stretching through. Good, on to the left side. Oh. Oh, that's alright. It's brighter today though, look. It is, isn't it? Earlier mornings, brighter mornings are coming. Stay down, mountain climbers. And squat thrusts. And up to our feet, into the cossack squats, nice and wide. Coming down low. Good, really come low. And arm go overhead into our squats. <laughs> My knees, I don't know if you can hear them, but they just click all the time. And into lunges, we lunge forward. And twist twice, okay? And change. Good, two more. One more. And jogging on the spot. Shake it out. Right. Okay, legs ready? Yeah. So today, just like Tuesday with the upper body, we have 12 leg exercises, well we had upper body on Tuesday, legs today, every single exercise you will need your weights or your weights, whatever you have, each exercise, oh sorry, apart from the top one. But but we still it's, need them. But it's, yeah we still need them but it's not the B word, so don't worry about that. Not the B word. Okay so 12 different exercises, 12 minutes, so one minute per exercise, you have 15 seconds transition time between each exercise, just enough time to catch your breath hopefully and watch the screen for the next exercise. However, if you do need longer rest, please take it. 
Um, that's absolutely fine, okay? Mm -hmm. I think you've covered everything. Yeah? Yeah. Are you ready? <laughs> ready. Right, first exercise. We've got a front squat, dumbbells or dumbbell in this kind of front rack position, but we're going to pulse. So down, pulse, and back up, okay? Yeah. If you've only got one um, piece of resistance, you can hold it in uh, a goblet hold or just on one shoulder. Yeah, that's what I do. Oh, we have got goblet squats so. though. Uh, yeah. Hold yeah. it on one shoulder. Yeah, maybe One shoulder, legs. okay? And then we pulse and then change. Okay, we have got eight seconds. No, five. Three, two, one. What are you laughing at now? Laughing at me is music. Oh, we've got to turn it, she's turning it on. Oh. A little handbag going off on one. People might be getting excited thinking we've got music to that. <laughs> so pulse at the bottom and then squeeze at the top. We like calling it the ugly bum. Don't we, Brian? The ugly bum. Yeah. And you squeeze it under, halfway. Change arms if you're using one. Four. 20 seconds. Fifteen. Last ten. And stop. Curtsy lunges. Here. We can do one side 30 seconds, the other side 30 seconds, okay? Yeah. Oh, no, I just did alternating. I know, if you've got one, just hold it in your chest. <laughs> Let's go. So one leg comes behind, we tap, and we go back. So, come in as low as you can. Great for the bum, this one. <laughs> Even you guys, Kevin, <laughs> do not neglect the peach. Halfway, change legs. When we um, did our competitions, Ray actually had a better bum than me. <laughs> I was so jealous. What do you mean when? Oh, you probably still do, to be fair. <laughs> 15 seconds. I'll let, I'll let you have that crown. <laughs> no, it's all right. 10 seconds. Good job I exercise to feel good these days. Yes. Five seconds. Looking good might just be a bonus, you know. Three, two, and one. We have got some swings. Dumbbells wide, legs wide, so hinge at the hips and thrust in as we swing up, okay? Yeah, you can do single arm or both, it's up to you. Really push with the hips. Let's go. I think we need to turn the bag off. <laughs> Keep holding them dumbbells. Yeah, right down the neck part. Don't you let go. Come on, really use the hips. Push back. Squeeze up. Halfway, change arms if we're using one. your balls out. 20 seconds. In here. Ooh, feeling them hammies. Come on, less than 10. Five. Ray, look at her. Where am I? She's got it on her arm, like. Okay, on the floor. Blue bridges. Oh. So you've got the weights or the weight on your lap or on your thighs and thrusting up through the through the heels. Let's go. Oh. So just tap the floor and then squeeze up. Pulls at the top for two, back down, and then squeeze. Half 
halfway guys. It's mad how much they develop from like the age of one, just like a couple of, literally every week's different, isn't it? Yeah. Keep pushing, keep pushing. What's the time, Mr. Wolf? We have 10 seconds. Come on, a few more reps. Ah, oh, bum's on fire. Yeah, bum should be on fire. Three, two, and one. Back to our feet. We've got front rack, forward lunges, alternating. Okay, so dumbbells up on our shoulders and just forward lunging, okay? If you're uh, low impact, you might want to just have a split stance like this, so you haven't got no impact at all and just drop down halfway, we will swap, okay? If you've got one, keep it on one side and then halfway will change. Coming as low as you can to the floor with the back knee. Halfway. Come on, keep pushing. 20 on the clock. Last 10 seconds. She's fine. She's so funny. Three seconds. And still. We've now got split stance deadlifts, okay? So one foot goes where the heel of the other foot is. The back, the front leg, sorry, stays straight. The back leg bends. And we come down that front leg, pushing the bum back, and then we squeeze up. Let's go. So front leg stays straight. Back leg bends, really feeling that stretch in the hamstring, nice and controlled. You can pull the, fr uh, the front foot, put the toes up to the sky for a deeper stretch, depending on how flexible you are, and the weight comes in front of the body. And change legs halfway. Something about this exercise I love. Just feeling it. Yeah. Right? 20 seconds. Good, keep going. 10 seconds. Five. And stop. Okay, Goblet. one dumbbell, or if you've got hex dumbbells like us. Goblet squats, okay, so hold both, and then we're just dropping down and going for reps, okay? Yeah. So you get a little bit of bicep burn as well because the isometric. Let's go. So let's go. If you've got round dumbbells, I don't recommend doing it with two. It's just not very safe. Or oh, we're not responsible for the damage. <laughs> this is your warning. Come on, squeeze up. Get them elbows as close to this. Wow, this is possible. Halfway, come on. Woo! Legs are awake now. They are. Come on, 20 on the clock. Ah, come on, 10 seconds. your side hip abduction okay so dumbbell one dumbbell on your on your fire you're just gonna raise up and lower slowly okay with that bum and the abductors on the outside of your upper fires slowly yeah try not to like bounce off the foot on the floor just yeah, if anything stop a few inches away yeah Halfway, we're going to swap, okay? So keep going. Oh. 
Last rep. Swap straight away. Quick as you can. Neither of us can see the time now. 20 seconds. It's alright. Fifteen. Oh, it's burning. How can you see it? Just look over my shoulder. Ten oh. seconds. Oh. I'm Keep going to hear the bell. Last one. Oh. That was retiring. Okay. Yeah. The time I've been doing it for years. <laughs> right, lateral lunges. Lateral lunges, okay? So legs open, nice and wide, dumbbells together, and we're just going to lateral lunge. Keep it chest up and just drop down. This is going to be a killer. I can feel it already. Okay. So just side to side, okay? Oh, so we did the outsides, now we're going to do the insides. So this one, adductors, A-D-D. -D. On the outside, A-B ductors. A-B-B. <laughs> Come on, halfway. Keep them weights in the middle, side to side. Twenty seconds. Bum as well. Yeah, we're giving the legs a once over all the way through. Come on, ten seconds. Three. And stop. Okay, burpee with the weights. Jump in, reverse lunge, reverse lunge, okay, and again. Yeah, low impact, just do the lunges. Oh, the Three. Way. Two, one. seconds. Keep going. Less than 10. Come on, last one. Three, two, and one. How oh, are this going to be good? Oh yes. <laughs> Weighted jump squat. So, dumbbells together, legs wide. In between the legs I'm going to jump. Yeah, low impact, don't jump. Just touch the floor and come back up, okay? So touch the floor with the weights and then jump up. Wow, Ooh. this is a burner. Halfway, we need a rest, shake it out. Come on, 20 on the clock. Wow, it's burning. Bend dumbbells on the floor, toe taps on the dumbbells, okay? Or if we can move the legs. Low impact, marching, touching each time. Three. Okay, on your toes. Ready? Go. Come on, nice and fast. Don't step on the dumbbells, just tap them. Final one, then we've got rest. A little calf burn on this one, stay on your toes. Get all the legs done. And the ticker as well. And the ticker. 
Halfway. Come on. Woo! Chest is burning. Come on. 20 on the clock. Push, push, push. 15. Last 10. Five seconds, don't stop. Stop. Oh, wow. Lovely chubby. Well done, everyone. Let's have a drink. That's round one done. We're going to do it all again. Okay? Doing really well. Very hard, this one. Mmm. We all still there? Hopefully. Can you not breathe? No, it's my back. Oh, careful. Okay, well done everyone. So you're halfway through your workout this morning. And uh, yes, we've got to do it all again, but we know what to expect now. Yes. I want to push it that little bit harder, right? Yeah, and um, although obviously our heart rate's up right now, this is what happens with um, boot camp with resistance, okay? Oh, you can see her head, like she's hanging out. Um, we're working the body with resistance, so it's a different type of intensity to the HIIT workouts. However, it's very high volume, which is what is going to get you the results, okay? Great for fat loss, great for muscle as well. So we're going to go through the whole thing again. We're at round two. Magical things happen, as you know. Just quickly, if you've got a heavier weight, start using it, even if you do half the exercise. Um, and if you haven't, just work a little bit faster. Yeah? And if you can, complete the four minute rather than take an extra rest. Obviously, if you do feel like you're going to collapse, then take the extra rest if you need it. But this is where we go in round two. We, we smash through that, that door, you know, that's just trying to close on our face. We're going to break through it, okay? We've got five seconds. Front squat, pulse it. Let's go, round two. Go, let's pulse. And squeeze. Come on. So you know what's coming now, or maybe you've forgotten, which is fine. <laughs> Halfway. on this side. And change, halfway. Twenty seconds. She's gonna be throwing the mask. Ten seconds, go on. Feel that stretch in the back of the legs. 
and the arms are just moving because the hips are pushing them up, okay? of the upper legs in the bottom of the glutes, bottom of the bum. Okay, you should feel that contraction. Oh, feels amazing. Oh, <laughs> it was amazing. It's just so good engaging. Oh. All right, all right, calm down. <laughs> You're like me this year, Mr. Potato. Uh, What's the time? Uh, 20 seconds, guys. So just squeeze at the top and tap the floor. Oh my gosh. Booty on fire. What a workout. 10 seconds. <clears throat> Three, two, and one. Back to our feet then. We've got the front rack, forward lunges. Okay, just alternating the legs. Dumbbells up on our shoulders if you can't, just up by your sides, it's fine. Oh. Come on then, three, oh. two, one. Okay. <laughs> Are you crazy, baby? What are you doing? <laughs> so get that back knee close to the floor, okay? And Try not to get sucked into the trap that a hundred glute bridges a day is going to build your bum. Because it won't. <laughs> Halfway, come on. Building muscle is all about fat loss too, okay? And when you use your body in entirety, like we're doing now, the more muscle mass you will have for fat loss to happen and sculpting in areas that you desire. But you can't spot reduce. Stop. Ooh. Split stance. That's this our RDLs, yeah? Yeah, so one foot in front of the other, coming down and squeeze up. Unfortunately, you can't spot reduce fat. If we could, we would tell you. <laughs> Ready? Go. Front leg, really stretching down. I think what Jordan's trying to say as well is that the leaner you are, the uh, more muscular you, you appear. Okay? Even for the females, like, we want to tone up. Toning is just uh, body fat reduction. And then your muscles just appear closer to the skin, which gives you that tone. Okay? Halfway, change. And it's so common, especially for girls, to say, I just want to get rid of my lower stomach. Like, is there a certain exercise to do? No, there's not. You could do hundreds of crunches a day, but if you've got body fat on your stomach, it's not gonna go by crunches. 15 seconds, come on. 10. And the most home equipment many of us have is a pair of dumbbells and a half our This This workout. <laughs> and stop. Goblet squats. There you go. Let's do some goblet so, squats. <laughs> you've got hexagon, then safely up in this goblet position. <laughs> Maybe Lily doesn't like us talking. <laughs> She's like, guys. <laughs> what is she even doing? About I don't know. Go on. Who needs music when you've got media? Go on. 
Get down low. Squeeze up, 40 on the clock. Halfway. Oh, come on. Bernie, Bernie, Bernie. So I was going to say this is the most um, equipment a lot of us have right now, a pair of dumbbells or household items, so this is the best thing we could be doing right now. Ah, uh, come on. And you're going to be amazed at the results you see. Stop. Laying down, we've got our hip abduction, okay? Just one on the side. On your fire. Under control. Why don't you do the other side first? Oh no, you just hang around. There. Yeah. Because <laughs> then I can see the cock for this one and you can see the cock for the next one. That's alright. Oh, I've got my balloons. Oh, oh dear. Amelia. Oops, all fall down. All fall down. Oopsie daisy. Ten seconds. Come on, feel that burn. Five seconds on this side. Three, two, and one. Change sides as quick as you can. Well, the post done the same. What? Change this way so that we can see the timer. What did I just say to you 30 seconds ago? You should go the other way. No, I said, no, that's right. Then when we change sides, you can see the timer. Oh, I, think, I, thought you, I didn't know you was going to do that. <laughs> Oh, who cares anyway? Oh, come on. Uh, great minds can go like, eh? There you go. And stop. Obviously, he doesn't listen to me. We are, we're in neck, not sweating. Right, let's go wide. We're in our lateral lunge. The weights are in the middle, and we're simply just going side to side, okay? Let's go. So, staying low. This one is deceivingly burning. Yes. Come on, stay low, side to side. Halfway.
Shake it out when you need to. Halfway. Come on, Jordan. Grit your teeth. Whoa. 15. switch off, log off till 8pm. Well, do obviously you, that's very demanding, but can you take work calls, like going for a walk? Like, do you, I think I'm pretty sure employment law says you're entitled to a lunch break, so what happens is, is you're actually putting your work before your own lunch break, and I can understand... And before your own life. Yeah, I can understand the pressures of a raise, the pressure of 
it's easy for me and Jordan to say because we work for ourselves. However, I did use Jordan. We both were employed in the past. And uh, this front leg, we're going to do a pigeon stretch. If you're entitled to a lunch break, which you are, then you then take it. Um, the work's not worth stretching about. Um, and uh, yeah, it's a tough one, isn't it? Because oh, your boss is going to use coronavirus as an excuse not to give you a raise this year. Most probably. Most probably. So you're putting in them extra hours, but is your boss going to say, you know what? No raises, no, no raises this year. And it means we affect you as well, like raising. I know it's easy for us to say because we're our own bosses, but we did used to both be employed. And your own mental health, if you're stuck at your dining room table from 8 till 8. But that's us, some people might have posh offices. Which you're stuck in your office. Um, that is mentally draining, like it has such a rebound effect on your own mental health. So just try and get out, um, even if you have to get up earlier to go for a walk and start your day. So. So coming up to the feet for the quad stretch, did you know the most success, I can't even say the word, successful. the most successful people in the world, I'm talking like your Apple owners, your Amazon, all of these people, they start their day by doing a walk or a type of exercise because they feel that their brain needs to be refreshed, active and taken away from their work before they start work. And it's so, so true, it just... If it means getting up half an hour earlier to just go for a walk and then come back and restart, I guarantee you will feel better. And if you don't, you still go on for a walk. It's win-win, right? <laughs> right, shake it off. Hopefully we've given you some inspiration. I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm a part owner of Apple. Yeah, no, you are. I own shares of Apple. <laughs> anyway. They're like, guys, you don't even understand what we go through. <laughs> right, guys. Um, thank you so much again. Tomorrow is here and abs. Uh, which will be day five of your February challenge and we hope you can join us because it's going to be a tough one as usual and always a challenge so thank you so much Come on, little bye bye marks. media says bye bye oh, let me get her because oh. she's all happy today well I don't know she might throw her head back again come here media say bye bye say goodbye to everyone can you give them a clap say clap clap clap, clap. there you go thank you guys have a great day like subscribe tag away and we'll see you tomorrow